Hello and good evening. My name is John. We're here playing 1111 Memories Retold as part of my Steam Cleaning series where I go through every game in my Steam library eventually, then arbitrarily rate and or review them after we've been playtime. I'm going to reach down and pick up my controller and plug it back into my computer so I can play this game with a controller instead of the keyboard. Now I do know what this game is because it is based on history, World War I to be exact. Does that mean I know what this game is about? No, but I at least have an idea. All right, this game supports autosave feature and it supports cats. Please don't turn off your system when you see the autosave icon. All right, new game. Complete and restart. Yes, I did start this before, but then I was testing it out. You know, you gotta test these games sometimes. Ardman and DigiArt, Memories Retold, 11.11. Elijah Wood, the Hobbit, Sebastian Koch. So what drew me to this game, and I did get it in a bundle at some point, uh, is that painterly look. It's got this weird oil paint. I shouldn't say weird. It has this uh, very specific oil painting look that you obviously don't see very frequently in game. November 1916, two years until peace. Cat. <clears throat> Toronto, Canada, a place that I have lived. Not in 1960, though. 16, not in 1916. I guess my story starts like so many others, with a girl. Is that Elijah Wood? Is he playing Harry? He worked in a photography store in a quiet little corner of Toronto, Canada. It is a nice shader, I have to say, I agree, but it's also killing my frame rate. Hold on. Let's see if I can adjust that. Uh, uh, uh. Most games don't like running a fork. You're not going to let me... What? Oh, no. No. It won't let me. The 29 hertz. Well, I guess I can't. I guess I can't go lower than 4K. Well, we'll have to deal with it as we go. Born the same month. Lived on the same block. To her, we were best friends. To me? Well, never mind. I know you have to test it, but does it always have to be on me? You're not getting a serious photo out of me. I can assure you of that. Oh, I'm getting photos. Until you put that camera away. How about now, Harry? How do I look? You look great. I oh, uh, four cameras. Okay. Oop. Perfect. Three pictures. Enter photo mode with Y and take pictures with A. All right. Oh, all right. Third person character. Morning, sir. How may I help? A portrait, perhaps? Yes, a uniform. Name's Barry. Major Barry. I'm looking for. Sorry, I really want to try this one more time here. Oh, hold on. Getting closer. There we go. Fly settings. Yes. Ooh. I didn't take it. Some of the recruits had it. Oh my. Well, flexible. How are things over in your unit? Collectible? As well as can be expected. He fights the good fight as best he can. Fine place you have here. Oh, I got a sneak button. 
Hello, Commander. I am sneaking. Boy, bring some wine for the Major. The good stuff. Upstairs. Who is this fine fellow, then? Your son, I take it. Oh, God, no. There's young Harry. Work for me. Julia, come over here and say hello to the Major. He's a real war hero pen and paper. You know, I have to realize now that streaming this is destructive on the bitrate because of the fuzziness like this is just the worst game bitrate for streaming it's just nothing but aliasing and artifacting so it's <laughs> that's why it's having so much trouble streaming it oh it's a good foley work on the the bottle to hear it go sloosh sloosh as you walk a lot of games wouldn't have that detail I just like sneaking. I need to go faster too. Hello, mister. Here's your stealth wine. Ah, here we are. You took your time, boy. You little poor lad. I'm sure he's trying his best. <laughs> here you are, Major. To your help. Why, thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Now, you said something about needing a photographer? Yes, yes. Who took these? They're exceptional. Just the kind of pictures I'd need in the fight against the Germans. Wait, you fight Germans with pictures? Whoa! All right, we just derezzed at that same moment in the Zeppelin factory of Germany. Ah, blödes Punker. Kurt, du bist der Techniker. Reparier das Ding. Brennt immer um dieselbe Zeit durch. Schnell, die Berichte kommen gleich. Yeah, you do lose a little bit of focus um, when you're trying to pick stuff out. All right, due to the shader aid. Oh, that was easy. I don't know if there's any other options that might help with the blurriness. I could desync, I could orient and aliasing. All that roller coaster requires. Okay. I'm not going to restart. Dear Katrin, I've done something I know you will not agree with. It's about Max. It's about our son. I know now why his letters on do not reach me at the farm. Kurt, wir warten schon. Zieh den Hebel. Die Ehre gebührt dir. I like to use the native language. I find that to be a, an advantage for games like this. Is that my entire job to pull that lever? Good job if you can get it. I do feel like you move faster when you're crouching. Oh, optional quest here. Keep your spirits up, friend. Those lovers are not going to pull themselves. I'd love to send a picture of this to my son. We need a photographer. Man, everybody needs a photographer. I'll be so fi proud when this ship finally flies. I mean, it animates well. A lot of background stuff is good. Um, controls as you would expect. Those sparks look weird. War bonds. All right, can I fall off? No. 
And I slide down the ladder like a cool person. Whoosh. No. Yeah, I don't know how it looks on the stream. Uh, my rendering of it looks really choppy on the encoder, but in, in action, in person, it looks really nice. Um, this is definitely like not, I don't expect this to be a challenge game. Like I don't think there'll be a lot of quick time events or like, um, you know, things that require a lot of skill. So this could definitely be a, a an ex story experience. Okay, well, I'm looking for, a, I'm looking for a lever. Oh, there's a collectible. That's why I came back here. War Bonds, part two. What do those look like? Uh, collectibles. Oh, wow. Okay. Actual... Actual bits. Oh. Hard to control in here. Huh. Okay. That's cool they have scans from... Um... Oh, can you switch characters? Oh, okay. So maybe you'll have an option to play both stories simultaneous. That's fascinating. Excuse me, I'm looking for a lever. We will serve our country well, Kurt. All right. Bronze misses Holmes. All right. Did this ladder. Now the guy who brought me in here is like, "Hey, just throw the lever by the ladder." I, I wonder if he's looking at me, going like, "Oh, <laughs> came into work again, and he's just not having it." Oh, someone left a collectible up here. At some point, the shader, some points, the shader does remind me of like a PS2 era software renderer or something. Um, but the fact that it, it's got like a little bit of like a, like a voxel mouthfeel, I don't know if I'm explaining that well, but like there's something about it that really does add some depth that, that feels good. Can you tell me what I'm, am I supposed to pull this lever again? Oh. It was there all along. See, and here I thought Zeppelins were always built by elves. Okay, Falk, I missed it. I was yammering, I missed the line. I should talk to Falk about our sons. Oh, that's not Falk. Oh, Falk, you're so so many la so many ladders. Have you no shame, my man? Alright. Oh! They auto-ducked for that. Good AI pathfinding. Or good uh, IK, I should say. Alright, what do we got here? Oh, little puzzle. Little puzzle. Whoop. This all looks very unsafe. There has got to be some OSHA violations going on here. All right, we'll go higher. I wouldn't want this job. Oh, what? What? All 
All right, I don't have any control over my, my leaning. This isn't a mini game. I'm just going forward. Many of us stationed here at the factory, oh, they all join up together from the same village. Wolf said it wasn't confirmed. I'm sure it's just a misunderstanding. Why would you make me do this? I want to believe that, but that was their unit number, and this is war. Kurt, your son Max is the same unit IR-125, or you must be worried too. Relax, you're only worrying because you're so far away from home. Can you ask the chief, Kurt? He'll know, and, he'll res and he respects you. Are you going to make me walk all the way back to home? Okay, no. So the pictures from Taylor's new camera were great. And Julia looked beautiful. But I'd never tell her that, of course. Don't know why, but I kept one of those photos. Still have it to this day. Because you're a creeper. That's why you kept No. Because you're a photographer. Interacting. I can choose. Oh, I get to choose the photo I like the most to keep? Let's take, let's take this one. Oh. Take a photograph of the basement. Okay. Come on, boys. Do your damn job. There's no rush. I sure the lad tried his best. Taking pictures of your choice. What, what you photograph will influence Harry's principles? That's a good one, boys. Oh. So, like, I have a morality system based on my photography? That's fascinating. Oh, I need objective pictures, not subjective ones. These are your current... Oh, they're for objectives, as in what I'm trying to accomplish. As a photographer, take this picture, open inquire. Uh, uh, Major, would you also mind a picture with my daughter, Julia? Not at all. Be oh, that's very subtle. They put a mark where I should stand. Okay. All right, game. I did it. Truth be told, I wish it was me in that photo. The way she was around Barrett. He's like twice her age. Julia was right. He was a hero. Okay, it's really creepy when they fade in people. Most of the boys from back home are in that unit. Please, Kurt, ask the chief. You know him the longest. He respects you. I should ask about the rumor. So, I could wander around looking for collectibles. I might if I was actually, like, trying to 100% this game. We all did. So many of us at the factory have sons who went to war together. Some were even in the same unit as Max. The chief had a direct line of communication to the front. If anyone knew the truth behind these rumors, it would be him. Ah, you come genau richtig. Es gibt Neuigkeiten. I must find my sons, whatever it takes. Wait, what is my objective? Well, that's a very broad objective. Some men from IR-125 may be missing, but does that mean they are dead? Narrator, they were dead. We will know more soon enough, but for now we must keep working. We cannot help them now. We can only pray. Pray. The others may have been content to pray, to hope for the best, but I could not. What became of our son's unit? I had to know. <laughs> Press A to enlist. So I have gone to the front, Katrin. I have gone to find Max. 
I guess that's slightly better than press Y for pay respects. In that very moment, I decided. I did it all for the nookie. I was going to war. Oh, sorry, I was going to war. I decided I was going to war. I left and never looked back. Even though it would get her in trouble, Julia gave me Mr. Taylor's best camera. Truth be told, I didn't ever want to go to war. I only ever wanted that uniform. Maybe one day, Julia would look at me the way she looked at Major Barrett. After that, it was all a bit of a blur. So much happened over that next month. They signed me up, put me on a train to the coast. They even gave me that uniform. You will think I'm impulsive, but to me, there, there was no choice. Our son is missing at war. I, I cannot deal with doubt. I will not live with uncertainty. This is my part now. Pretty compelling story. December 1916. Two years until... Alright. Laurentic ship approaching France. France. German train to Western Front. A boat. And before I knew it, I was taking photos in the middle of the ocean. I'd never even left Canada, let alone been on a ship before. You could have fit Taylor's whole photography store on the front deck alone. I'd wake up early each morning to practice with my camera. We must have been close to shore that day. For the first time in weeks, I saw birds. All right. Oh my goodness. The camera Julia gave me was marvelous. The best I'd ever used. I could even change the lens to see things close up. That's that's what you had before. Nope. I want to push this button. I'm in the military. Why do we even have that bell? So it's one of those weird things when you gamify, you know, historical war knowledge. Like, why is there a crate pushing puzzle on this? Like, are they trying to tell the story of the war or are they trying to make a video game and they're kind of stuck with like, well, we got to have a crate puzzle. It's a video game. We got to have collectibles. It's a video game. We got to have crouching and sneaking. Oh, I do have a run button now. Oh, sweet. All right. Well, I need to find more birds. I don't... Oh, okay. My uh, detective vision has shown me there's a seagull over there. with customers back home. But we did it! I didn't know what to expect. Everyone said the Germans were crazy. <laughs> I should be taking this more seriously. Alright, so you, you have to play both things in lockstep. I guess you get a little choice. Maybe this expands as you go deeper. They're not going to kick me out of the army for ringing a bell. For you, my darling, nothing changed. I will still be away from home. Only now, I will carry out my duties as an engineer on the front lines. I will enclose a letter to Lucy to tell her I, I have gone to find her brother. 
feel like it's got some really great vistas and stuff like it's it's got such a good look What day is it? I can't run, but I can fast walk. Quiet down, we'll be back home in a month or two. I don't think they would let you walk around like this. I mean, I would be nervous about that. Are we the baddies, Claws? Munition cart, you can't be here. Okay. Why are you traveling by train? Who's talking? Oh, there we go. Of seagulls won't make the papers, son. Or rather for that girl back home. Trust me, she's not interested. But she will be once you and I make those headlines together. Come on, let's get a few practice shots up at the bow. Get the flag in the photo, Harry. People love that kind of thing. You're the photographer, so how do I look best? Oh yeah. Here's an idea. You, private, get over here on the double. That's it. Smile for the camera, Miller. Generic Canadian. Last one, Harry. Let's try one with the ocean in the background. Ooh, low angle, make him look taller. There we go. Oh, no, wrong button. This, low angle. There we go. Now we're talking. I think you get CC. Oh, mines. Looking for a place for home. I shouldn't be able to do this with these musicians. Okay. Oh, levers! Oh, I was born for this. Oh. What is this lever doing? Can we talk about this cat for a second here? That's a cat, right? It's like a war cat? A battle cat, if you will. Chillin'. I don't know how that lever worked. Alright, we'll go around. Oh no. Oh my goodness, it's a mini game. Look lively, lad. I'll tell the captain. You keep your eyes on the sea. So, there I was, running left and right, 
ringing those bells like I was in church. I don't expect you to believe me, but I'm telling you, that's what happened. To this day, I don't know why Barrett asked me to signal the captain. But for the first time in my life, I felt like I had purpose. This is why we practice bell ringing. You all thought I was a fool. That is a lot of mines. All right, we did it. Victory lap. Through without a scratch. I knew you had it in you, lad. Keep it up and that girl back home will be yours in no time. Ha! Now there's a photo for you, Harry. The king's finest. Clearing the path. HMS Dublin. The more you speak and listen, the more you'll be able to tell your family. Oh, interesting. That's like kind of interesting, yeah, kind of fun mechanic where you talk to people to have more to write about. My name's Lothar. Oh my god, is there going to be a mini game where we... Uh, what's this? Oh no, am I jumping out? Oh, I'm sitting down. Okay, whew. And so I found some words to write. To focus on what I must tell our daughter. I will, of course, be careful of the words I use. She's still so young. Please tell Lucy. Wow. Okay, I have to actually write a letter. Think carefully about you tell Kurt's eight-year-old daughter. It'll have impact on the story. Uh. Oh, that's cool. You get to. I want to be honest. I'm going to war. Oh, Vimy keyword is locked. I've also locked the keyword of arrows per buck. Okay. Well, we're only about a half hour into 11.11 Memories Retold. Uh, I like it. I I would like to play more of it. I'm fascinated by some of the systems. Uh, I am mixed when it comes to the gamification of some of the stuff. Like, I don't know. It it tells a good story that the gameplay of like ringing the bell back and forth or, um, you know, taking photos of seagulls feels like it's forced to just justify the fact that it's a game where the storytelling with Kurt and like having to talk to people to to find things to write about that feels much more organic and in place and the stuff they tacked on for um layers of you know stealth mechanics and fetch quests and it just feels like you know why 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 deviate from what's the strengths and put in the gameplay stuff that doesn't seem to reinforce it well, also, we know 20 months, to, so we know this is a ticking clock when it comes to the game. Um, yeah.
So this has been Memories Retold 1111. That's not the order in which the title is written, but that's the order in which I read it. Um, yeah, I like it. Cheers. <laughs>